21 minutes and 9 seconds seconds to body strength and sandy max 30. That is when I maxed out. So today's workout just reaffirmed to me that this program and everything in life is so mental. Um, today is Christmas Day. Merry Christmas. Happy Holidays. This video will not be going up now, so it'll be way past by the time this goes up. And today will also be the last time I do this daily video blog. You're gonna hear kids in the background. I would say sorry, but listen, it's Christmas. Like It's the holidays, everybody is home and together. So I did what I needed to do. I told you guys in the last uh, Max Out video that I wasn't sure how today was gonna work because I wanted to wake up super duper early and do my workout, but I do fun little things for Christmas. Like I do, um, footprints on the floor like Santa Claus came in the house you know I do the cookies and the milk and um, presents by the cookies and the milk so my fear was that one of my children would wake up early out of excitement and then I would be in the middle of working out or I'd be sweaty and um, I'd have to do the rest of the morning like that so I wanted to be completely present in those moments so I skipped the workout this morning and to be honest with you I thought I wasn't going to get it in because it is about eight o'clock at night right now. And, um, you know, during the day I was like, I don't know when I'm gonna do it because, you know, I got three hours of sleep last night between preparing for Christmas stuff and my husband woke up sick in the middle of the night. Um, also, I'm glad I didn't do it in the morning because my son ended up waking up shortly after six um, and came and laid with me on the couch and went back to sleep. So that didn't happen, or that did happen. And um, so it was a good thing I didn't do my workout, but it just, it really is so mental because, you know, I, I, I kept the workout on my mind all day. I didn't let it, like, hinder me or um, separate me from the moments I had with my family, but it was in the back of my mind, you know, every so often I was like, I can do the workout tonight before bed. Like, I can do it, even if I'm going to be tired, I can still do it. And we had a little bit of downtime, um, and I just thought, you know what, I'm going to do my workout really quick. I'm not taking away time from the family. Um, because my kids, you know, we went out to some two different houses today. So they're back and they're watching their movies that they got for Christmas. So while they're relaxing, I'm in here doing my workout. And I just went into this workout today like, you know, I want to feel good at the end of this day. And always, like, I'm happy. I love Christmas. I love this time of year. So I really am the happiest that I ever am. And I just wanted to be complete in all aspects. I wanted to be with my family. I wanted to spend some time with my team of coaches. I wanted to spend some time with you guys. I wanted to um, be with my kids and do my workout, feel good about my body, healthy, and eat well, and that's what I did. So it just goes to show that you can do it if you set your mind to it. There's no excuse that you can't do it. There is, ex There are excuses, and I've used them. I've used them plenty of times, but what I'm saying is, it's okay to have excuses and to not do workouts, but if you want to do it, you can. And those excuses, you'll find ways, you'll find solutions, you'll find ways around it. So a million different reasons why I could not have done this workout today, but I did it on Christmas Day and I feel great about it. And I am just loving it. And today's workout was amazing. And I cannot believe that I went over 20 minutes for my max out time. There were plenty of times when I wanted to quit, when I told my mind, you know, for instance, I got to 12 minutes and I'm like, I know the only other time you've maxed out this far in the game is during one of the workouts at 14 minutes and it wasn't this workout. So you're doing, you know, better than you've done the majority of the time. You can quit now. And I was like, no, I want to see how far I can push myself. Then I'd get 16 minutes and I was like, I'm really tired, my muscles are kind of giving, maybe I'm not going as quick as I should, maybe I should max out, and then I was like, no, I want to prove to myself that I can do this on a busy, busy day when I got no sleep, when I have a million things to be doing, and I did it, and you can do it too. So Tabata Strength, second time doing this workout, the first time I did it, I think I maxed out at like seven minutes and something, so I went from seven minutes to 20 something minutes, which I can only say that's mental. It's nothing else, it is only mental. My body was just as capable of maxing out 20 minutes last time I did this workout, but I believe I even told you guys that that workout felt like torture because my mind was not in the right state. So I just heard a Christmas ornament break and I'm gonna go 
check that out. Thank you guys again. This will be the last video diary um, until like day 30. But you guys can do it. And I highly recommend this program if you get a chance to get your hands on it. And I will see you guys in the next video. Bye and Merry Christmas.